Welcome to Maple Ridge Chrysler, my name is Jamarley and today I'll be showing you this 2015 Dodge Grand Caravan Crew with Flex Fuel in black. This is a great family vehicle and I'm going to show you a bunch of reasons why you should come down here and check it out for yourself. Starting up here at the front of the vehicle you will see your halogen headlamps mixed with your fog lamps down here at the bottom making sure that you stay nice and safe in the dark and that you'll see in low visibility situations. Underneath this hood you have a 3.6 liter V6. VVT Pentastar engine. This is a powerful engine. It's actually award-winning and legendary. It'll help you pull up to 3,500 pounds while still maintaining great fuel economy. Now coming down here to the wheels, you will see your 17-inch completely aluminum rims wrapped in your Yokohama tires. These tires have a great amount of tread, so you're not going to replace, worry about replacing those anytime soon. To the side of the vehicle, we have our breakaway mirrors. They bend both to the front and to the back in order to get out of the way instead of you having to replace them in a minor incident. They are also heated so that you're not going to have to worry about them in the winter. Now let's step inside. As we're about to step into the vehicle, I just want to point out that we have a panic button up top, our unlock button, and our lock button. It's going to unlock the driver's side, and then press unlock for the rest of the vehicle. And here in the driver's side of the door, you'll notice that we have our power mirror controls, our power window controls, with along with this one, and our power locks. There's a great amount of storage in the door, as well as a light for seeing in the dark, as well as a water bottle holder. Now here to the side of the seats, you'll notice your controls for your seat going forward and backwards, adjusting the tilt of the back, as well as the height of the seat. We can also adjust our back lumbar support. That is actually amazing for keeping our back well supported while on those long drives, making sure that we leave the vehicle without aches and pains. Now here to the left side of the steering wheel, you'll notice that we have our headlamp controls as well as below here we have our parking brake and our release lever for our uh, hood. Now I'm just going to close the door behind me and start up this vehicle. So just bear with me for a second. Going to put the key in the ignition. And here we have it. Now right now you're looking at our cluster display with our tachometer on the left, speedometer on the right, with your digital screen here in the center that's showing us the direction we're facing showing us the temperature outside, as well as showing us our kilometers per hour or miles per hour, which is a quick and easy change of a click of a button. And it's currently showing that this vehicle has 21,800 kilometers on it, which is actually nice and low for the vehicle. Now we're just gonna go back and click through a few of the other options, like our trip information, our vehicle information, which consists of our coolant temperature, oil temperature, oil pressure, and so much more. As well, there's our messages screen that actually alerts us when we need to service things like your oil or change or get your airbags uh, serviced, which is actually really helpful for keeping your vehicle in tip-top shape. Now, coming out to the wheel, you'll notice that we have our voice recognition control buttons that actually allow us to control the phone in our calls or text messages while keeping our hands on the wheel and eyes up on the road. We also have our buttons here to control that digital display. Over here we have our cruise control settings. As well, we have our shifter over here, which I'm just gonna drop into reverse just to show you that we actually have uh, a backup cam equipped in this vehicle, which is super helpful for seeing behind you when you're trying to park or reverse. As well, we have this large screen that you just saw your backup cam um, displayed on. It also has our voice recognition controls here. Your radio, Sirius satellite radio, isn't actually on this vehicle, but you can purchase the subscription. As well, you can load CDs and DVDs into this uh, player right here. As well, it has a built-in hard drive in this vehicle, allowing you to store music and other media on the go. You can also connect um, a phone or other mobile media devices via USB or auxiliary jack. Coming down here, you'll see your climate controls for both your driver's side, your passenger side, and the rear can be controlled from here as well. Here you have your econ button your hazard button, your power button for the back AC plug, and your traction control. There's a great amount of storage, as I mentioned, as I, this vehicle has so much storage of these two large glove compartments, and even the storage under the center console, it's great, with two large glove compartments over on the passenger side. Now looking up, before we step out of this beautiful leather upholstered vehicle, we look up and we'll see a large sunroof up above. Look how amazing that looks great for the summer just to add some air 
as well we have this center area with this mirror to see behind us and keeping an eye on uh, passengers behind you as well we have the buttons to open up the doors and the buttons to open up the sunroof and while we're still up here I just want to point out that we have a universal garage remote now let's step around to the back one of my most favorite things about this Dodge Grand Caravan is the amount of buttons around this remote. And so I'm just going to quickly show you, we can actually either use our hands and we can pull the door handle and the door will slide away pretty much like magic. Or you can use the buttons here and you can double tap it and you'll notice that the door on the other side will open up as well. It also does that for the back gate. Now looking inside this vehicle you'll see um, just like we saw in the front great leather upholstery. I also want to point out that the front seats actually have an active headrest in the case of an accident they will adjust in order to minimize the movement of your head reducing the amount of injury which is a great feature in this vehicle. We also have our seat back pockets here and as well we have our third zone of climate controls right here with our lights here and a storage compartment in the ceiling that's really helpful now this vehicle is actually full of storage and so i'm going to quickly show you the stow and go um, compartment here below now below we can also keep um, our groceries we can tie them in into these uh, grocery bag hooks or or we can actually stow away our seat and i'm going to quickly show you how to do that all you have to do is fold up the seat's arms and then this happens really quick. You pull this lever and it just folds up. So like look, it folds all the way in and with one hand there, we've done it. We've put it into the ground. No more having to like unlatch it out of the ground and get help to pick it up out of the van. It just goes right into the floor, nice, quick and easy. As well in the back seat, you'll notice we have here our 60-40 split, great leather upholstery again. The back has speakers and another one of these um, overhead compartments with cup holders in the back. As well, you have an AC plug right here. You can plug whatever you want in as well as a DC plug right there. Now as we step outside the vehicle, you'll notice we have a retractable roof rack on the back. And now I'm just going to open up the trunk really quickly by double pressing this button. It'll begin to beep and it'll lift up. You'll also notice that we have here our backup camera. And now as we're looking into the back seat, again I want to show that there's a ton of room in this area. Great for storing cargo as well when you're ready to close up the trunk. All you gotta do is tap this button and it'll fold back down by itself. Now as we get into actually showing you how the stow and go works in the back, there's actually two different kinds of settings and one of the settings is actually a stadium seating setting. So all you gotta do is pull number one and pull number three and it'll detach from the floor and you pull it down and there's actually like seats right here at the back of your tailgate making sure that you're comfortable at those soccer games or when you're having a tailgate party. As well, it's also easy to do stow and go. You just follow the numbers. As I mentioned before, you pull one, the head Wrestle come down, you pull two, the seat back goes down, you pull three, it detaches from the floor, and you pull four, it folds right in nice and easy. Look at that, amazing. I want to thank you so much for doing this quick walk around of this 2015 Dodge Grand Caravan Crew with Flex Fuel in black. Hope you'll come down to Maple Ridge Chrysler to check out this vehicle or other new and used options. Remember, we're closer than you think. Bye bye.